In this illustration, we'll discuss about turning of a two-wheeler on a road of varying friction. Here we are given that a rider on a bike takes a turn on a circular road where the friction coefficient depends on the radial distance from center R as mu is mu naught 1 minus R by B, where mu naught and B are constants. And we are required to find the radius of circle in which a rider can take a safe turn with maximum velocity. Also, we are required to find this maximum velocity. So, in this situation, we can make use of the concept we have studied in concept videos that for safe turning, maximum speed in a circular track is this is given as root of mu rg that we already studied. This implies here this maximum speed will be root of uh, mu we can substitute as mu naught 1 minus r by b multiplied by rg. So here we can see this maximum speed in which uh, the rider can ride a bike uh, depends on uh, radius r. So we can write this uh, v is maximum 1. Here a student must not confuse that if this is the maximum speed then it will be for a particular radius. When it depends on radius then there exists one radius at which this maximum speed will be maximum. So here v is maximum when dv over dr should be equals to zero. So we differentiate this relation this mu naught and g are constant so this r minus r square by b when we differentiate this 1 minus 2 r by b this should be equals to 0 which implies the value of r we are getting is b by 2. So in this uh, radius uh, the speed will be maximum that is one result of the problem and r we can substitute here to find this maximum speed which is given by root of uh, this mu naught 1 minus r if you put as b by 2 it is 1 by 2 multiplied by b by 2 multiplied by g and on simplifying we are getting it 1 by 2 root of mu naught bg that is another result of the problem for maximum speed.